Hey guys, so Trucker one right here with the little, uh, they call them tips on trucking. So I'm here in New Mexico, like uh, halfway through to do my uh, generator delivery. But at the same time, I finish my driving hours and I have to do the restart for 35 hours. So it's cheaper for me to stay in a hotel than in a truck. Maybe it sounds crazy, but the hotel here, next to this uh, Lowe's truck stop, it uh, was a deal, it was like $56 per night, breakfast included, and then you can sleep in the real bed, and then uh, you can have a nice shower, and uh, when you calculate it, it's actually cheaper because your truck, right now it's uh, still March, the beginning of March, the day can get hot, but then the nights get cold. So you basically, for the 30, 35 hours that I have to be parked here, probably gonna spend maybe 20 hours with the engine on. And since my truck is using like half a gallon an hour, that will make it like 20 gallons. And since the price of the diesel right now is crazy, right here in Rose it's 550. So uh, that will make it 20 by five. So it's already 100 bucks. And that's uh, you have to think about. You don't you sleep in your truck. You're gonna listen to your engine, and even if you don't have your engine, you're gonna listen to other driver engines. So it's kind of like not really a rest. And I think it's uh, companies they should pay for uh, for your rest if you're arrested to do it on the road. They should pay for your hotel. But uh, me, I pay for myself. So was in my charge but I said it's basically cheaper to stay in a hotel than stay in my truck because of how much the, the gas is gonna use the truck so I'm here at this uh, Daisy Inn hotel this is the main entry it's a cheap two stars hotel but two st I prefer two stars hotel than my truck and especially if it's the same price so uh, let me show you the room this is the Typical road, hotel, hostel, whatever you guys want to call them. So I'm here at 102. Put the card in. And let's see what you get for. Maybe it's the opposite way. What you get for 50 bucks, breakfast included. Okay. No lights here. Bathtub and the toilets, pretty clean for this money. We have the sink here. Something what I don't really like in the some hostel when you have the sink outside of the of the bathroom. But yeah, so this is the room, guys, for fifty bucks. And how I said, breakfast included. I'm ground floor, but it's the side of the opposite of the freeway so I'm not gonna hear the traffic so that's it this is how uh, I prefer spending on this room than stay in my truck for two days so uh, thank you guys for watching this is some tips how you can spend it outside of your truck for the same amount of price